So to end all confusion about how to load my uh, Cork DW8000 SysX Bank into your DW8000 or EX8000, here's exactly how to do it. First, you take your MIDI interface and be aware that not all MIDI interfaces work on all types of SysX data. I'm using a Roland UM1, which works perfectly. So you take the MIDI in and connect to the DW8000's MIDI in, and you take the MIDI out of the MIDI interface and connect to the MIDI out of the Korg DW8000. Be uh, sure to put the Korg DW8000 in right enable, that's on the back, on the EX8000, that's on the front. And the program I'm going to use is the program called Sendex by Boom. That's free. I'll leave a link for you in the description. And you have to load in the SysX data into your MIDI transfer program, of course, which I have done here. The file you get when you download my patch bank or any other SysX patch bank for these synths. In the SysX program, be sure to uh, enable your MIDI interface that you're actually using. So I'm going to set the Roland UM1 to both MIDI in and out in the SysX program. And then there are two parameters in the synth itself that has to be right. The first is parameter 84, MIDI channel. Set that to MIDI channel 1. And the other one is parameter number 85. Note data. Set that to setting number two. And that's it. All you have to do now is press send data in the SysX transit program and check out the display on the synth itself. It just counts up from uh, patch number 11 to patch number 88 and you're done. You have the new bank installed in your DW8000. And if you have the EX8000, it's exactly the same. Put it in right enable. Uh, change parameter 84 to uh, MIDI channel 1 and change parameter number 85 to setting number 2. Easy peasy, nothing to it. But be aware, I remind you again, not all MIDI interfaces are the same. So uh, it might be that you have to change out your MIDI interface to get a SysX transfer going, even if you do all the right moves like I showed you. In over 30 years, I've never come across one DW8000 that was enabled to receive MIDI SysX data. That part of the synth is never broken, in my experience. So, uh, good luck!